Hey, Shalom Israel, all praise to the Most High, Bishop Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ, here in Atlanta. We have a special guest, Rudolph R. Windsor, the famous author of From Babylon to Timbuktu and several other volumes he has written. And we wanted, he came, he came here uh, to uh, introduce himself and we wanted to introduce him. All of you know him, you may have never met him, but he's here in Atlanta. Introduce yourself to everybody. Let us know about it. Yes, well, I'm, my name is Rudolph Windsor, and uh, I was originally born in uh, Long Branch, New Jersey, uh, back in uh, 1935. And uh, I uh, once uh, heard a rabbi, a black rabbi it was, who came on radio, and I was listening to him in Asbury Park, New Jersey. And he was saying that the black people in the United States of America are the true Israelites, where black people were the true Israelites. So immediately that sparked my attention and I said to my brothers, my brother Cole, I said, let's go over there right now where he was broadcasting from. And we joined up with the movement at that time. This was back in 1953. All praises. And uh, yeah, so we learned his, I was still in high school at that time. And, <laughs> and we were learning black history and so forth about the Israelites. And I went to school and I asked him, my, my homeroom teacher, was a, um, uh, a history teacher, and I said to her, uh, was, was King Solomon a black man? She looked at me with a strange and evil look, and she said, he had a little nigger blood in him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. But anyway, uh, so uh, yeah, at, eventually I moved to Philadelphia in 1955 and uh, studied uh, Hebrew language and uh, more Hebrew. Uh, history and culture and so forth, you know, and uh, I raised my family there and uh, in 1992 uh, I moved down to Atlanta, Georgia area. Mm. Uh, and you've been, since 92, you've been out here in Atlanta? Since 92, yes. Uh -huh. In your book, uh, Babylon of Timbuktu, that's one of the favorite books, mm -hmm. uh, I want you to go into, because you go into a lot of history regarding Israel along the west coast of Africa. Talk to us about that. Let me ask you this, because there's, a, there's two trains of thought that I've heard people say. Some people uh, have uh, made the claim that some Israelites, Israelites still are on the west coast. Some Israelites say they're all gone out of there. So what do you think the validity? You think that there's still some there? Oh yes, yeah, yes. Uh, I have been to the west coast of Africa. I've been to South Africa and I met the Hebrews down there called the Limbus. Yes, yes. Uh, and I met okay. them there. And I, in fact, I was invited over to South Africa by uh, Sammy Mowedi, who is now deceased. May he rest in peace. Uh, he was a he was in the parliament of uh, at the time that Man Mandela was uh, in office. Right. Okay. And he was a Hebrew and he's from the Limba tribe. And uh, I was a guest of his, his over there for about two weeks. Um, so uh, there, then there's, there's other Israelites in the country just north of that. I believe it's uh, Zambia, I believe it is. Okay. And that's Zambia. And that's the Denver tribe. Uh, and there in Nigeria, there are, are the Igbos. The Igbos in here. The Igbos. And, uh, and, and, and uh, you know, evidently you know French then, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I understand what happens. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the word, uh, he, he, in fact, uh, the word Ebo, 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 I don't know if you heard of this, but yeah. Ebo, that's the way you say Hebrew. Hmm. The way you say in French. Oh, okay. You say Ebo, Ebo. It means Hebrew. Okay. You see? Gotcha. Uh -huh. So, uh, a lot of, uh, you know, uh, Israelites in uh, southern Nigeria. And in the, the country next door, it used to be called Dahomey. Right, I've but, read about Dahomey. Yeah, right. yeah, but now called Benin. Benin. In fact, in fact, that word Benin is a, con, a corruption or contraction from the Hebrew word Benaim Ephraim, hmm. which means the children of Ephraim. Now that's in your book. Yes. I, I came across <laughs> it. I was that, like, wow. Uh, yeah, you remember that. That's right. You? That's, that's right. Yeah. Okay. You have been an excellent researcher, you know, in, in this time. I have not met anyone your equal in it, when it comes to uh, researching Israelite history from times past. Okay. So outside of your book, it's just the Bible. We got Bible, Josephus, of course, uh, Phalo, as you mentioned, and uh, I think uh, a few others. But 
uh, in terms of modern, you have not met your equal when it comes to the research on Israel, the diaspora of Israel. You've done a, a phenomenal, phenomenal work, phenomenal. And we thank the Lord and, and definitely give all, all praises. 